Terve ja hyvää päivää. This is Mika and I'm going to play some chips challenge. Cloners Maze Asterix. It's the Lynx version of the level. And I was going to play around and see if we can figure out an easy solution for this. At the start of the level, you have to clone. At, at the start of the level, there are some bombs to destroy. So I'm going to make 16 gliders. One, two. Whoops. At the start of the level, there are some bombs to destroy. So I'm going to just start off with making 16 gliders. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. And now uh, we've destroyed the bombs and we have two gliders and traps. And of course this level is pretty complicated and you could solve it without any collisions. Well, almost any collisions, but any tricky timing stuff as the um, split second timing as the hint said. But I put together a few tricks that makes it a little bit easier. I try to make the, uh, condense the tricks to the start of the level. So if you mess up, you can just start over, but there is one, one later on. So this is the first trick I'd like to show where after clearing all the bombs and having two gliders in the traps, just ma making a collision with two new gliders. So like this, let's follow them to see what happens. And unlike MS, Gliders will not die in the fire, and one will come back and collide with this one and get stuck in the trap. We'll do that again, and we'll get rid of this bomb here. And that's the easiest way to get rid of this bomb. Now the other glider comes and uh, hits this bomb, which is really great for us. I won't take that chip yet just to demonstrate what, what's going on. So let's do that again. We're going to go like this, a little delay there. and. And I'll just follow the glider to see that we got the correct collision. Yes, exactly like this. Now let's learn the other, other, other tr little trick, and it's going to be very similar except we move six, six extra moves in between. So we go glider and come back. Now I bump into the wall to get the timing correct, but if your movement is not perfect. Um, you pro you probably can get away without the bump. So just clone, walk to this square and go back and clone again. And it's very likely that you lose a little bit of time on the on the movement if you're not. Oh no! <laughs> if you're not no, <laughs> perfectly comfortable with links movement let's so let's let's do all that again so we go one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen then we do this little trick then you you can't do it immediately afterwards because otherwise the gliders will collide in unwanted ways and now once you've made sure that one of them is in this trap uh, the other one will go and destroy that other bomb and we'll do the same thing again like this and so i'll just release this one to um, get to the next stage and there we have successfully freed this chip and let's do the other uh, other timing trick we go like this a little notch there and i just like following this to see that I get the desired collision. No. Okay. So there I made the mistake that I forgot that I had um, freed this trap. And then I should have uh, loaded the traps again before make, doing the movement. Yeah. So the, the timing trick. So of course this way, now we get a collision. No. With, with cheap and the <laughs> Yes. Hopefully. Uh, 
your attempts are better than mine. Let's go again. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. And now we have destroyed a lot of bombs and we have two gliders in the trap. So now we do the first timing version where we get a collision and we get this lower trap loaded. Yes. Then we go back and do it again. And you know what? I'm gonna just come over here. That's the glider from the first first round and here we get this this um, chip. Now the next maneuver w is to get this red key. So what what we do is we go like this and no I, I, I was thinking thinking about the traps if they were loaded. So let's first load this trap, wait a little bit for that glider to go by, and then we'll do this one and here. And then let's go check if we get the desired um, collision. So this frees this guy so that we get the red key. but in addition to freeing that guy, it comes and gets stuck on this trap, which is good because we want to do that again. And now we wait, and when it comes around, we'll come from below and come and hit this uh, bomb to free the red key. But while all this has been going on, this this guy is going to go around and open this bomb. Now you could get here by uh, maneuvering the block on the right onto the trap button there and you could just get to this upper area through the trap but since we already did all this work with the gliders I, I like how it opens up the path to this upper area and we get the green key. And the green key is important to get. And if you get a glider stuck up here before you get the green key, the level is cooked. So um, it's better to get this sooner than later. And and this is also a solution to the original version of the level in Lynx, where there is no floor tile on this particular square, which was added for this Lynx version, just to ma make it a little bit easier if you want to use the block solution and not the glider collision solution for this section. Oh uh, no, we have one extra glider going around here. You know what, let's use that for... Oh! Ah! Oh, I should have been more careful. I, I was gonna... We could use it for this bomb. But, um... Oh man, sorry for dragging the video out so long. I'll just have to go again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. And then the timing trick like this. And then I use this time to go free this. So that's ready for the next section. I refill that trap and then I do the timing trick again. Like this. Let's go have a look. I'm gonna free this trap again. And now I, I'm just going to go down here to make sure we haven't got the right collisions. Yes, we're ready for the next step. Phase. Uh, refill the trap and longer um, pause between gliders. And this one will come down. This. So now we have uh, we've done the second trick to once. And we need to do it again. That one was for the trap, and then we go like this. Let's go see what's going on in here. So there's going to be a collision here. This one goes up, and it will free this red key. Yep. And I, I have to go get this red key and this key while um, chip while I'm down here. Um. Let's see. The next one we want, we wanted a glider to come bounce off this 
and I'll open this. Yeah. So this one goes around and destroy that one. While I'm here, I'm going to open this red door. And now I'm going to go up here and get the all important green key. And now I'm ready to uh, set up the collision up top here. I'm going to need two gliders. Um, first, I'm not quite ready for that top section yet. I'm sorry. I need to first blow up this bomb. So for that, I'm going to push this block up here and clone a glider. And then I just wait. And while I wait, I'm going to go and see what I can use my time for. I can go like this. Let's get this red key. And get this chip from down here. And then we have to remember to refill this trap. And, and here comes the glider. And it frees this glider to go up top. And we get this chip. So now we need another glider in this trap. So we just uh, make one glider. And it goes and bounces off these and eventually we'll end up in the trap. So while I wait for that, I'm going to go and do this section. One, two, three, four. Now this section is a bit scary because you can do too many, too many um, um, gliders and it'll fill up the level. So I like to make a little precaution here. If if something happens and you get a glider stuck in here, it, it can press the blue key. Now, if you press the blue key yourself twice in a row and a third time, you will keep the it toggles the green doors twice, but it moves the tank to the other side. So now we're free to go to the exit if we want to. Okay, and here comes the glider for this trap. Now we're ready to cause the collision up here. Uh, let's free this guy. And the timing for this, and I'm, I'm pausing this to, to explain it, is I wait here next to this green door, and, it's and this door is closed. And when the glider that's up on the top row bounces off this door, I run. And you, then there's a certain path I take so that the two, two gliders will collide. I'll show you. There it goes. And then I come this way. I go around here and I come along here and I press this. And that's the correct timing for these two to collide and for me to reach the yellow key. Now, if you mess up, it's okay. Uh, you can just go and make more gliders, wait for them to get into this trap, and release them up into the uh, upper area. It's just you'll need like four or five of them together to be sure that one of them will come and destroy this. So if you get it right on the first try, that's the quickest way. But if you're only looking to solve the level, it, it's you you won't cook it even if you mess up that timing timing trick. So it's okay. Now there's one more uh, chip to get. So I'm going to use this glider. Did I I open that red door? Yeah, that that was. Important. I open the red door so that this one goes over here, and now I have all the chips, and I exit with a solution that took just over five minutes. Wow. So hopefully that's a little bit of help for some of those tricky chips. And just for fun, I'm going to try again, and I'm going to see if I can do it a little bit quicker, because I've mapped out what I need to do. So let's hope I can remember everything. Let's go. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. And I'm going to do the timing trick immediately on the 17th. Free this one and then go back to load. And timing trick number 2. And now here I deviate a little bit from what I did before. I'm just going to make an extra timing trick 3, which... Oh, no there like this which um gets me the last two gliders to the end 
a little quicker than normal. And now I'm ready for timing trick number two. Here we go. Like this. And then I just want to go and clear this one. And timing trick number two again. And then while I wait for the first fighter to come here, I'm going to open this red lock. And then just wait around. And this one is going to go and free that uh, bomb, blow up the bomb, so I get have access to this top area. And then I'm going to come back down. What do I do now? I have no clue. <laughs> Maybe I just go down and pick up all the stuff I've taken before. I was freed up before, and then then I'll be ready to get the collision at the top. I think. Let's just pick up this and open this. Set that up for when I'm gonna free it. This double okay, and then one, two, three, four, one, two, three, and then pick up the chips and then get ready for this timing trick here and run for it. Oh, here we go. And timing. Hope we get the correct collision. Pick up the yellow key. Have I picked up everything? Yeah, one chip left. Is the tank in the right place? And we get an 838. Oh! So there we go. And now I didn't uh, do that all perfect. Uh, there was some hesitations and waiting. So I'm pretty happy. I got over 800 seconds, which which is more than the uh, what we know is possible in MA. So, and uh, I'll have to check if this is um, partial bold or... Uh, oh, I, I didn't even check what the um, public score is yet. So uh, I'll be excited to check that and it's an interesting label it's it's my favorite level in cclp2 so hopefully you enjoyed and hopefully there was some help here for you to solve solve this level too and i'm sure there's ways to get in much faster time than i did here but um, this was an attempt to connect um some of the easy timing tricks into a solution and that's it for today uh, Thanks for watching and see you again some other time.